It's a very positive message. It's something that's going to make you feel really good. It's a blessing. And it's going to make you feel nurtured and cared for. Well, that's awesome. And let's take a look at this hero fant. We got release and vision quest. So somebody that you let go of, or maybe it's... I feel like somebody feels like they were left out in the desert here because we got the release in the desert. So somebody feels like that and they want to make things right with you. I also feel like... Some of you had to let go of somebody and now you're just kind of looking towards the future. But we'll get more. Oh, I didn't get one on that. Let me get one more on this one. On the call. We got the perfect storm on the call. And then we got ebb and flow. Well, isn't that ironic? So whatever this call is about, you're being told to just chill, okay? Just go with the flow, even though it could be something that's dramatic. But you're also getting communication about something very positive that's going to make you feel really good. And then there's this call. Somebody maybe that you had some drama with wants to make things cool with you as well. On the patience, we got the purification and the open book. So somebody you've been waiting for has been letting go of a lot of things that aren't working for them. And maybe they were closed off in the past and now they want to be open with you. And on the justice, we got lightning, power, and end of days. Yeah, so this is over. Whatever this court case was for you, it's going to definitely work out in your favor in a pretty rapid way as well. And I also feel like somebody wants to come through and apologize. For those of you that applies, they're having a breakthrough. Yep. So what do we got in this king of air over here? As above, so below in completion. So this is all about astrology and the transits and the universe having a plan. And some of you definitely put an ending with an air sign person, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. And it was meant to happen for whatever reason. And on this water, which could be you, Cancers, it says heal yourself and activation. Like something in you has been activated to heal yourself, to let go of whatever wasn't working in some sort of situation here. It could be with an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. It could be. Or a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. But I also have an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini there. Somebody that you you left or they left you. It was meant to happen as above, so below. Also about astrological transits that's maybe helping them go to a completion with themselves. Or it was part of a completion that you needed to go through with this person. Or you will be going through. And then you're being told to heal yourself. Or it could be with a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces that's now healing and wanting to take action as well for some of you. Let me get... Can you tell me about this? We got the Piper on the King of Swords, which is about seduction. It can be romantic. It can be seduction. It could be this person's very luring to you. They were. 
there was something about him that you just really were drawn to. I also feel like they are going to try to make a romantic attempt is what I just got. Let me see. A romantic attempt. What? Give me something else on this Piper and the King of Swords. We got the Dark Lady. Very passionate connection between the two of you here. Okay. Um, this person might be deeply spiritual or you may have a subconscious connection to this person that somehow keeps you kind of kind of entwined with them somehow, psychically, emotionally, uh, just I feel like this person is trying to manifest you back too because this is about subconscious power. And this is about like romancing or seduction. I think for some of you, that's how they saw you too. Very um, dark lady Piper. Like you, you were all like, you kind of kept them spellbound. But then we got the completion. Maybe some of you ended this on the full moon with this person or they, you. But this as above, so below is like meant to be. But there was a strong, magnetic, passionate connection. And I think they're kind of, I feel like there's a little bit of obsession here. What the heck? Let's see. Fairy Godmother. Yeah, they want to... They are, they, are, they, they are wanting to get you back. Or you want to get them back. But I feel like... This is a very uh, sexual, passionate... energy going on here and this is about like making things come true something you did activated this person or they you yeah because we got solace on on the water sign scorpio cancer pisces this could be you but healing the power of healing and this is also of just pure power inner power activated from this connection or the situation illumination seeing things being activated in you surprise gotcha unexpected event that's really quite powerful here this was a shock that's why it activated you guys to heal yourself whatever this situation was you were shocked i am trying to find out you guys i'm sorry it's like this is just really interesting here yep so this is tying up loose ends or trying to make something right
fixing the situation, wanting to make it right. This person has unfinished business with you or they think they do or they want to and they want to try to get you back. They're subconsciously trying to. They might try to seduce you. They might send you a message because they want to somehow get you back and they want to make things right. But I'm getting this completion here, which maybe you guys ended it on the full moon or maybe it's just the completion of a cycle with this person. But I'm seeing it as you ended it and they want you back there. They want to maybe they didn't get closure. Maybe they're feeling they're subconsciously trying to use all their inner will to get you back. They want to try to lure you back. <laughs> this is crazy. They want to tie up loose ends or they want to um, make it right. But whatever happened here, it was a total shock to you and it activated you to go for inner healing. If this is you, this could be another water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. Maybe you guys did that to them. It could be vice versa. But I'm seeing an air sign here, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Sun, Moon, or Rising. They could be a combination of water and air. They could be um, whatever. Or this is you, Cancer, really trying to heal after the situation. I see somebody leaving somebody and this is like, whoa, sorry. Yeah, we got the singer of healing that just flew out. And this is a, really about healing. Some of you are trying to heal from somebody. Yeah, see, and this release, okay, there was something definitely, this is like the nightmare card, and it's on this release. Some of you thought that something was going to turn out serious, and it was it turned out to be a nightmare. It turned out to be delusion. It turned out to be something. You had a different vision of this person and you released them. And we got honesty, which is also self delusion could be either or on this messenger of air. But I think it's I think what's happening is some truth is coming through and it's going to make you feel really good and it's a blessing in disguise coming through on this um, message. Somebody wants to be honest and it's going to make you feel really good over here. So you guys are going to get a message that's really positive that's going to make you feel really good. Some of you are dealing with a nightmare situation. something that was just that you had to heal from and then yep we got the soul shrinker over here okay you guys I'm sorry I love you guys I'm not I'm not making this happen there's a call that you may have gotten or you're gonna get or you're gonna hear about somebody saying something negative somebody using malicious words harsh words whatever it is it's coming in with the perfect storm and then we got ebb and flow which tells me just hang up the phone don't even take it just ignore it don't just don't even listen to it okay this is some sort of gossip some sort of harsh words some sort of slander some sort of just malicious it could have already happened and some of you may have had somebody say that to you say these to, do this to you already or it's a call that's coming in and you just need to be the ocean and just be calm and ignore it Maybe that's why you're going into this calm space of like, I just need to be alone. That is absolute nonsense. And then you're going through a purification, just saying relax, be patient. 
there's some sort of passion coming through here and it could be for some of you okay there's a new love offer coming through from another water sign cancer scorpio or pisces could be a leo sagittarius or aries who has a lot of passion for you and they are going to be a surprise to you that's going to help heal you in a big way okay and it's going to activate a part of you that you were hoping to be activated rather than this other person whatever this other person did they want to come back and make things right with you also but i see a new person coming in for some of you as well okay that's going to be really powerful and it's going to be a surprise and it's going to heal you we got two healing cards on it and activation so for those of you that it resonates with where you were going through a nightmare with somebody literally how whatever that means to you okay maybe you felt like you were alone in it they were just it was just it was a nightmare it was like okay you release them you thought it was going to be something better and you release them you got out of it okay and it could be this air sign person but they don't have to be an air sign person they're just kind of cool just whatever they're going through some some transits as above so below that's gonna help that's gonna teach them a little lesson okay or you ended it completed it with them and they're trying to subconsciously try to get you back in somehow or they might write you a message trying to seduce you or get you back because they really really want you back and they want to try to make things right they feel like they didn't get closure. They feel like something here, okay? But for a lot of you, I feel like you're going through a purification from something toxic that was stressing you out. You left. You had an awakening. You were like, oh my gosh, I need out of this situation. And maybe there was harsh words said. It could be um, from the same person. You had a, you know, it was a call and it was like the perfect storm for you. And they said some mean things or harsh things or whatever. Or this could be coming, for those of you and you're being told just to chill out everything's going to be fine because there's a new love coming in that's totally going to activate you and heal you from this whole situation oh my gosh <sighs> cancers i love you guys i'm sorry i don't know this reading is really you know it looks like for those of you that this resonates don't worry you got positive stuff coming through here you got a new love interest that's going to really heal you you got two healing cards back to back an activation and it could be a water sign sun moon or rising you got this air sign that wants to make things right with you but it looks like they were the nightmare or toxic but they didn't have to be the one that was okay you know it could be the water sign person it could be a fire sign person but however it applies there is somebody that wants to make it right with you and then there's also you going through some something very toxic heavy whatever it was with with somebody harsh words or even if it was a co-worker situation somebody slandering you whatever it is this is like slander um mean words harsh words having it out with somebody along with this perfect storm could have been a really tough situation call or communication with somebody but you're going through, a, you're taking a time out, you're going through this pur purification, letting go of that, I see you released it, and then this new passionate start comes in, this new person, the saving grace, that has a ton of passion for you, that's honest and forthright and direct and a surprise to you, that's gonna help you heal and activate a part of you that you did not know was going on. You weren't expecting it. All right, Cancers. Well, for those of you that this resonates in one way, shape, or form, take whichever story goes along with you. It could be a friend, a family member, an ex-lover, a lover, whatever it was. At the end of the day, there's a new person coming in that's going to help heal you and activate you. And you're going to be letting go of some stuff and purifying. And there is somebody that I think wants to come back that wasn't making you very happy. All right, Cancer. So this is what I have for you guys. I love you so much. Um, remember, the roles can always be reversed. Could be the opposite. However it resonates, I send you guys positive energy. All my love to you. Thank you so much.